Hey there, Boots Owen here. I've been running this machine as a workshop washing machine to do workshop rags for a few weeks now. Maybe not even a few weeks. And it's come to my attention that it's grim inside. I should have paid more attention to that. But it's mouldy in there, it's mouldy here. So I'm going to have a go at cleaning this. This bit I will do in the sink. And then the other bit in there I'll have to do in situ. So I'll give it a bit of a general clean up and hopefully it'll, it'll come up all right. So I've got a bowl of clean water, relatively clean, and a washing up brush. Normally they clean up quite easily. This comes out, siphon. making it worse because my hands are filthy. <laughs> oh dear me. Right, we're back to zero there. So I learned to do this, or I learned that it even needed doing when I lived in rented houses. Places are better than others is all I can say. Got a bottle brush here to get in. So that's pretty clean now. This is not as clean as it could be. Let's give it another little bit. Off, I'm gonna go over it with a sponge and washing up liquid because it's a bit still not a hundred percent. Feels like there's a bit of scale or something there. Or maybe there is. Lime scale or that, possibly. The other option you have with these is putting them in a dishwasher. You could do that. It would work quite well. So that's a lot better now. And that just snaps back in there. Why is there more stuff appearing? As if by magic. Congealed fabric softener that somehow I didn't reach. Very strange. Okay. So 
for now, we have to figure out how to get this inner bit clean. Let's take half a jug of water, half a bowl of water, and the brush. So, it's a bit grim in there. So I'm gonna try and just keep taking wet brushfuls of water. You can see how dirty that water is there on the front. upside down bit because it's got black mold on top it's the outside bit clean the upside down bit inside that's the hardest. You could take the plastic out, take the top off, take out these two screws and take the hoses off the back and the front. It's not easy. this the best thing to do is to do a rinse in the machine to get all this water out of it the dirty stuff so I've got a bottle a spray bottle it used to be Used to be for some detergent or something. So I've got a garden sprayer here. Already a lot better. I can see, but you can't. It's a bit of dirt down there. I get a bit of bottle brush into the hose or the outlet of the tank. From, so we get the bottle brush down into the drain from this drawer. Filthy. Right, I think we're almost there. So a final rinse then, I guess. So then, I don't think I'm going to get it much cleaner than that without taking it out and putting it in the dishwasher. Likewise, the drawer, it's pretty good. Let's put it in. And you'd never know. Okay, time for this machine to do a bit of work. Questions or comments, leave them below. Thanks for watching. See you later.